about it. Good job, Batman. Yeah, nice work. City of fear, my ass! With my hay fever, I'd normally be complaining about this much pollen in the air. But screw it. Ivy did it. She saved us. Hey, not taking anything away from you. You're still the man. With my hay fever, I'd normally be complaining about this much pollen in the air. But screw it. I know the toxin's cleared, but it ain't fun standing out here. We barely made it inside when the cloudburst went off. Hey, on the flip side, I guess releasing that stuff wiped out a few bad guys, huh? Won't hear me complaining. I know the toxins cleared, but it ain't fun standing out here. We barely made it inside. We could have some kind of battle going on out there earlier. I'm guessing they came off worse. Driving that thing, I'm not surprised. <laughs> Policing these streets is gonna seem like a cakewalk after this. You know, that's funny. Thinking about the future doesn't seem so crazy anymore. I'll be honest, Batman. Didn't think I'd ever be grateful to breathe good old polluted Gotham air again. The city must have looked pretty messed up covered in that stuff. Once you see something like that, it stays with you forever. Thanks, Batman. I didn't think we were going to make it back there. Good thing we got everyone inside before the toxin hit. You might not have had much to come back to otherwise. We can't give up. That's what they want. They want the world to see it's hopeless. Well, I don't believe that. There's always hope. Sorry, Batman. We had no idea. Internal Affairs had their eye on someone at GCPD and... Looks like we know who it was. Let me tell you a secret. You're never gonna win this war. It's over for you. And when he does, you can't keep us in here forever, Batman. We're getting out. Believe it. You're never gonna win this war. It's over for you. You ain't gonna find the other weapons, Batman. No way. Penguin's too smart for you. Cash went up top, said the city's looking back to normal. Apart from the tanks and stuff. I think I'll leave it a while. Maybe an hour or two. Yeah, you don't want to end up like Owens. Without that weapon, Scarecrow's nothing. You got him now, Batman. You should have heard the cheers that went around this place when the toxin cleared. Cash brought us right back down to Earth, but for a moment it felt pretty good to be winning. That's a big screw you to Scarecrow for the whole world to see. This is our city, not his. Any leads on Gordon? He's out there. I know it. Just hope we find him before they do. That's a big screw you to Scarecrow for the whole world to see. Gotham ain't going city, down yet, Batman. His. Thanks to you. Some of your men have picked up an encrypted message. How did you... Stupid question. McAllister's back there in the comms room. It's got us all scratching our heads. Doesn't seem real, Batman. I can't imagine what Jim's gonna do. Barbara was everything to him. Tell me about this broadcast. Wish I could, sir, but it's on a SWAT channel. Encrypted. Those boys really don't like anyone listening in. I'm in. It's Jim. I need you to send through some blueprints. I found Crane, and that bastard's going to die for what he did to my little girl. Was that the commissioner? What's he doing? Getting himself killed. But I've got the ID number of the radio he's using, and that means I can track him. 
You gotta find him back, man, before it's too late. The cloudburst was screwing with radio frequency, so militia switched briefly to open channels. Sounds like the knights disappeared. They're scrambling, Batman. You've got him on the run. I've decoded a radio transmission. It's Gordon. He's alive! I need you to isolate the radio's frequency and pinpoint its location. Of course, sir. The transmission appears to have originated from an abandoned shopping mall. The building has been without power for some time, sir. You may well encounter some obstacles. The remote electrical charge prototype is being held in the GCPD evidence room. That should help. Very well, sir. I'm sure Officer Cash will understand. Doesn't seem real, Batman. I can't imagine what Jim's gonna do. Barbara was everything to him. Can't tell you how grateful we are, Batman. We got our city back. Well, the breathable part, anyway. What's Gotham gonna be like when all this is over? Whoever wins, things ain't gonna be the same again. Any luck deciphering that message? Comms guys are in the dark. I can just imagine the news coverage on this whole thing. Probably got the whole world glued to their TVs. This is my memorial, huh? <sighs> Not even a statue. They think they can just file me away, don't they? I've been sent back for a reason, Bruce, and no one's forgetting me this time around. One stuffed bear and a canister of Titan formula. Owned by Bane, a.k.a. Unknown. <sighs> we had to let Bane loose after the Arkham City fallout. Guy was messed up anyway. Serious Titan withdrawal. My guess, he's off somewhere getting clean. And he's not going to be happy when he comes back. One vial of Titan formula. One set of wind-up explosive false teeth. One pair of actual X-ray specs. One toy gun loaded with one toy flag and five real bullets. All used by the Joker. No known alias. It's one hell of a toy box. I'm glad no one's gonna play with it again. This ain't right, Brucey. My stuff's not meant to be gawked at. That gun should be out there sticking up old ladies. That dynamite should be bringing the roof down on a kindergarten. All that senseless misery going to waste. <laughs> one custom tailored top hat, worn by Jervis Tetch, aka the Mad Hatter. Guys, you know how long it takes to make an explosive set of chattering teeth? I hope you enjoyed the joke. I did it all for you. I hated letting him go. This guy's too creepy to stay free. One rifle and two wrist-mounted guns used by Floyd Lawton, a.k.a. Deadshot. Another guy we had to let go after Arkham City got shut down. Still... That doesn't mean he got his toys back. One Arkham Asylum branded shock collar, worn by Killer Croc, a.k.a. Waylon Jones. We found this thing in the sewers under Arkham City. And that ain't good, because it was supposed to keep that bastard under control. Two ceremonial swords used by Rosh. I mean, Rish al Ghul. We found these at the bottom of Wonder Tower the night of Protocol 10. They were covered in blood. Nobody, though. One pair of 
shock gloves worn by the electrocutioner, a.k.a. Lester Buczynski. Joker hired this guy on the night of the Black Gate riots, and then he killed him. I heard Batman borrowed these for a while before handing them in. I guess he prefers beating up punks the old-fashioned way. One mask and jacket worn by Anarchy, a.k.a. Lonnie Machen. I wasn't even a cop when this kid tried to hit Gotham. No one's seen him since. No one knows where they're keeping him. I guess the government don't like anarchists too much. A selection of body parts belonging to Warren White, a.k.a. the Great White Shark. White got himself sent to Arkham on an insanity plea. He lost a few things other than his mind while there. Made the new look work, though, I gotta say. One freeze ray, used by Mr. Freeze, a.k.a. Victor Freeze. We, uh, had to stop playing with this after the commissioner caught us making ice cream. Freeze has kept quiet since leaving Arkham City. Maybe Batman finally talked some sense into him. One ventriloquist dummy, a.k.a. Scarface. This ain't the original Scarface. It's a Joker knockoff. Don't ask me why, but the clown took a liking to these creepy things. One laughing gas grenade, one snare trap, and one baseball bat. All used by Dr. Harleen Quinzel, a.k.a. Harley Quinn, during a recent assault on the Bloodhaven police station. From what we gather... Scarecrow sent Harley to break out Poison Ivy from the lockup in blood. One black mask worn by Black Mask, a.k.a. Roman Sionis. Sionis never really recovered from the night of the Black Gate riots, the night Joker showed up. Roman was an old-school gangster. Joker, well, I'm not sure what he was. Talia. I'm sorry. One ceremonial sword owned by Talia Al Ghul. Miss Al Ghul was a wanted terrorist and an associate of her father, Raish. But Joker got to her before we did. From what I hear, Batman put this blade to good work after she died. One Tommy gun, used by Peyton Riley. A.K.A. the ventriloquist. Or maybe the gun belongs to the puppet. I never really understood what's going on there. One electric charge gun used by Batman, A.K.A. We don't like to ask. Batman dropped this here with the rest of the Arkham City evidence. Nice to have some of Batman's gear in the evidence room. Hope he doesn't ask for it back. Okay, now I can go after Jim. <laughs> Very subtle. I know this is the evidence room, Bruce, but you could have tried to cover your tracks. We don't like to ask. Batman dropped this here with the rest of the army. I ain't stopping him. Don't look at me. Hope you have luck decoding that message. Could be the lead we've been waiting for. Doesn't seem real, Batman. I can't imagine what Jim's gonna do. Barbara was everything to him. The fools in here actually think you're winning. Deluded, Batman. They must get it from you. How many wars have you fought, Batman? This army knows how to survive. Do you? I'm glad Owens is better. He's still worried. They don't know if that stuff has done any long-term damage.
You'll find him. I know it. Good luck out there, Batman. Signal is coming from behind that shutter. I need to find a way to reach him. 